Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today is going to be a huge Stony Clover haul. Stony Clover Lane recently collaborated with Target to kind of have a more affordable line and where more people could shop the brand and that's what this video is going to be today. I have a huge haul for you guys. It is a little late but that is okay. Late is better than never. I would love to know what you guys got as well. So make sure you let me know down below, but let's go ahead and get started. So I spent way much more money than I care to share, <laughs> than I would have liked to, but when I got in Target, I was just so excited. Everything was so beautiful, and I've been wanting to shop Stony Clover Lane for a long time. They are kind of big in the Disney community on Instagram and that's where I know them from is from the Disney community on Instagram so they sell like travel bags luggage makeup bags and they have this kind of thing where like you buy the bags you buy the patches and then you can customize your own bags that way but they are pricey so when they collaborated with Target it was like perfect pretty much anybody could shop it and you could also shop it online but I'm gonna start out with the smaller items and I pretty much got everything in each category and I didn't get it just to you know show it off but I got it because I just loved everything I didn't even know I was gonna make a video until I thought about it but um, so the first thing I got is these cute little luggage tags I got the one that is plaid it really reminds me of Easter but the colors are gorgeous and I don't have a luggage tag I don't travel a lot to where I would need a luggage tag but I think it's nice to have one and I believe it was only five dollars I have prices listed on the screen as I talk about it as long as I can remember or um, find the price that it was so and now I just gotta buy a cute suitcase suitcases are expensive <laughs> okay next one was completely random this is a power bank and this thing is heavy but it's super cute it's yellow with green palm trees and I just thought this would be perfect for the parks and it's just summery in Florida I live in Florida so it fits the whole vibe and I don't really have a power bank and I thought that was really smart to probably get one especially for content for the parks and stuff like that so that's why I picked this up and plus it's super cute these went pretty fast too this is the number one item that I wanted randomly I'm a big straw person and when I seen these I knew I had to have them these went super fast fast like if you blinked they were gone you if you wanted them you had to get there early and you had to snatch and grab them they went super quick so you get four I believe there's silicone straws and then four charms to go with the straws the colors are cute the design is cute and these are like they're just cute that's that's all there is to it I love having reusable straws and these were only five dollars I would have thought these would have been closer to 10 15 but they were only five and definitely worth five dollars they are precious that looks so good with the Starbucks cups okay next up is a planner and this is something that I was debating on before Stony Clover did a launch with Target was getting one of these like planners and I just love the plaid the colors in this one but it's basically like a daily planner it's not dated which is really nice so this is what it looks like inside I love the big spiral I love that you can fold it back I love the size of it so it's like perfect size wise it says you got this it has a to do top priority goals how did I shine today I'm grateful for and self-love adjectives I'm not gonna lie I'm not going to use this every single day so I like that it's undated <laughs> and um, I've been wanting a planner to kind of plan out my content because I've learned recently that I do better when I write stuff down and I know what I need to accomplish and get it done and I believe this was only $15 so not bad and they had a couple of different designs as well I just love the plot. Need a last minute grab. I did go to two different targets. Me and my mom went back and forth to targets all day. Like it was ridiculous actually. But it was a lot of fun. So the lady set this out right in front of my face. And if you know me, I'm a huge makeup lover. And I seen these online and I was like, oh, I don't need that. So I didn't buy it online. Um, some of this stuff I bought online, some of it I bought in store, but I could have bought it all in store because it was all available. 
even though it said a lot of the stuff online was not available in the store. This is the makeup brush set and they have like little sparkles in the brush handles which is super cute. The brushes look super soft, they look like really good quality. But yeah, I just thought why not, you could travel with it. It has some face brushes and then it has some eye brushes so I'll definitely be getting my use out of this. I of course picked up some patches but a lot of them I did went ahead and customized the bags that I picked up. But if you're wondering, this is what the patches looked like, like the packaging that it came in. So I have an extra little rainbow and I have an extra little heart. And then I got the travel, the glam, and a couple other little icons. So these were adorable. These were $5 each. And all it is is adhesive. They just stick on. But it says if you want to make it more permanent, then you can sew it on. But I do not know how to sew. So adhesive it is. <laughs> okay, so I got these pair of shoes. I seen these before the launch and I knew I had to grab these. These are so, so cute on. They're pretty chunky. They're chunky little sandals. I love how it velcros. I love this little heart right here. That is precious. And the colors, the colors are gorgeous. They're, I love like the pastel bright colors. And all the colors are just so summery and spring. I just love the whole color scheme of the whole collection. And I knew right away I had to have these. So I'm so happy I was able to get my hands on them. My rabbit chewed the end of the shoe. Are you kidding me? Already? Look at that. My rabbit was bad. He already chewed the end of the shoe. I can't keep nothing nice around here. <laughs> Partly my fault because it was on the floor, but bad, bad bunny. Hopefully he didn't chew on anything else because he like anything foam or um, like rubber, he goes nuts for. So and that's kind of like more foamy. Hopefully he didn't chew on none of the luggage things. Or, oof. I spent a lot of money, that's bad. <laughs> but um, okay, so here is what I put the glam on. So the patches, they came in little icons and also glam travel, beach I believe, and swim. And I got the glam one right here and I put it on my Allie Glines makeup bag just because I thought it'd be super cute with the gray background. I know it's not perfect. I've never done this before but I think it turned out super cute. So I just wanted to show you kind of what it looks like on um, a makeup bag and stuff like that. And I'm fixing to show you the bags as well. So this is my glam and I love it. I think it's fun. So going in, I just didn't want to buy bags just to buy bags just, you know, because it was Stony Clover. I wanted to have an idea of what I was going to use it for. So I got this little round yellow one and I put the little daisy on here. This was not on here. I put it on there. They did sell bags with some icons on it, but this is what it looks like. It's just like the pastel bright yellow and then I added the little daisy because I thought it was just so cute together and what I bought this bag for was to keep my Sony camera in here for vlogging and um, my little tripod like batteries I have a little mini tripod and I think it'll fit in here as well and then like you know just like the extra batteries or the chargers the wires cables whatever but yeah I just this is gonna be my little camera bag and I thought it was so cute so I had to get it and I love this yellow color besides the sandals another thing that I knew I wanted was the fanny pack and I wanted it in white I think they had green they had purple or like kind of like a lavender they had pink and they had blue blue sold out so fast and so I was not able to get that one but the one I wanted was white and this is the last one so I was so happy I was able to grab it some of them are like this satin material and then like the green one was kind of like a terry cloth material and it has kind of like this little rainbow band right here so I bought the little rainbow icon and I thought that just so perfect together so again this did not come with this icon on it I put it on there but how cute is that I'm so happy to finally have a fanny pack oh, I love that I was able to customize it a little bit it's one of my favorite purchases okay speaking of the terry cloth things 
So this is the other bag that I bought. I feel like this is going to be my swim bag, you know, keep my bikinis in here or even like another type of makeup bag. I really like this one because of the bow on it and I could carry it like this and I just thought that was so convenient. I don't know why but I feel like it's so convenient. I didn't want to put any icons on this one because I want to go to the Stony Clover store in Orlando. I forgot what hotel it's in but it's in a resort not a hotel, a resort, and I want to get like little Mickey and Minnie patches and put on this one because I think it'd be really, really cute. But the cutest part about this one is the inside. It has that same plaid lining, so the lining is plaid and it does have a zipper, which is really, really nice. Right, so here is my luggage bag that I picked out. As you can see, I already put the travel on here, which is really cute and it goes really well with this tie-dye bag. And then on the little pocket on the back, I put a B for my name. And these are really, really nice. These were $40. They're pretty good quality. It does come with the strap. It does not have any pockets inside at all. So it's just like one big tote basically. There's no pockets inside. Here is the strap right here. I kind of wish there was pockets, like at least one pocket, but there's no pockets. <laughs> and I notice a lot of tote bags like this don't have pockets, but I do like that there is an easy access pocket on the outside. But the only thing I don't understand is it has a zipper underneath. So if it somehow gets unzipped, anything in this pocket can fall out. I don't, I don't know what that's about, but it's still super cute. I really, really like it. And originally I got the purple one, which is a terry cloth material. They had purple hearts all over it, which is super cute. And I seen this one at another Target and I swapped the purple one for this tie dye one. And I love the way the travel looks on here. Um, my mom got the pretty blue one and we put travel on that as well with a white heart on the pocket super cute. I'll show it right here so you guys can see it. But this was the last thing that I purchased throughout the day. Like I have other stuff to show but this was the last thing that I decided to buy. So this is the clear beach bag. Again, I just love the color scheme. The little gold hearts are cute and I don't have a beach bag. And I love that it was clear. I don't know why. I just, I do. And I don't think I'm going to put any icons or anything on this. I don't know. I kind of just like it clear and just colorful the way it is. Okay, clothes. So, I actually was not going to buy any clothes. Me and my mom went to the first Target and we basically got like all the bags, you know, the shoes, and I bought one swimsuit, which I will show you that right now. And it was the one that I absolutely wanted. I knew if I could find it, it was the one that I wanted. I will say their swimsuits did run big. <laughs> um, so this is the bottoms of the swimsuit. It was the pink plaid one. And usually I wear large in bottoms and this I got a medium in and it literally fits me. Perfect. I don't think I've ever had a better fitting swimsuit bottom ever. Like it, it's so good. It's just the way that it fits. It's perfect. And then the top is kind of like a bra type top. So this is the top right here. Fits perfect. This does fit true to size to me. I'm usually a medium and that's what I bought it in. The way that it's shaped and cut really flatters my type of body. This is the back. So yeah, I was so happy I was able to get my hands on this one. And that again, it's one of my favorite purchases. So when we went to the other Target, bear, <laughs> like almost everything was gone. I did decide to try on a two-piece set that they had and I actually really liked it. And um, I kind of had the lady talk me into it, but once I tried it on, I really did like it. So I got the green stripe set and I love um, tops that tie like this so I was immediately like drawn to it but this is what it looks like it's kind of like a cute little pastel green striped crop tank with little ties on it I usually am not a fan of like the really flowy tops because you know it kind of makes you look a little bigger than what you are and um, kind of insecure about that right now but 
this was really really cute and honestly it really <laughs> kind of reminds me of a pajama set but I think it's adorable especially the shorts these remind me of pajama shorts um, but on they are adorable and together it's such a cute little outfit so these I both got in medium again the bottoms especially in this collection did run pretty big so I had to size down and basically everything and I also got the pants or the joggers and I really like the little beads I thought these were adorable these ran super big and I had to size down in two sizes so this is a small a medium fit good but it was pretty baggy so a small fit perfectly and a large was way too big and usually that's what I get as a large and this is what the bottoms look like it has my favorite cuffed bottoms I prefer a cuffed bottom but yeah these were super cute they're like that terry towel cloth material and they do have pockets okay, and the so last two items I actually bought two days after the Stony Clover Target launch actually it was the next day not two days but I went back and bought two more bathing suits and my boyfriend helped me pick them out he loves white swimsuits so I did end up getting the white one and I tried it on and it is super flattering super cute I love that the back has a pink heart really really cute just like standard bottoms that one's really nice and then I also got the blue plaid one which was one of the ones that I liked but I didn't know if it would look good on me but the top is really nice and I really liked it on the bottoms uh, I mean they're not bad but they're super revealing I guess like this is pretty low cut like it goes pretty low <laughs> and it's definitely big enough like it fits me if I were to get a large it would probably be too baggy especially in the back end I do like that it stretches so you can kind of customize it you know bring it more around for more coverage but the front is really where I'm kind of like, it's a little iffy. Like it's a little, I, I definitely would not wear this to a water park. 100% would not because I feel like these would literally just slide right off. <laughs> but for sunbathing, you know, by the pool, it's perfect. Yeah, that is everything that I bought from the Stony Clover and Target collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun. I believe that's everything. I think it's everything. <laughs> I had so much fun shopping this collection and let me know if you got anything. I was really debated on that cooler. I think I just like the idea that I could put stickers on it. I ended up passing on the cooler because I knew I wouldn't use it that much, but I wanted it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to try posting more on this channel. I haven't posted in a very long time, but that's because we don't really go to Disney right now anymore and I've been running a business and trying to do Instagram and TikTok. Like, it's been a lot, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys!